Hey guys, Master Dromeo here, and welcome to my the second episode of my Jurassic World Evolution um, park that I'm building with unit, guys. Now, you'll notice that uh, I put dinosaurs in these two enclosures and made these two enclosures and this, which we'll get into in a minute. Well, I've recorded a second episode, but then when I found out Sand came into the game the next morning, I deleted it to record the Sand on Nublar episode for my uh, safari park. So, you guys, so some updates first. Now, I don't want this channel to be a gaming channel for this game. Now, this game is great and it has actually helped me gain uh, some subscribers, but um, I really do love this game. But some up, this was supposed to be a figure. Uh, figures, main, paleontology, the close second, gaming would be like a third party, but gaming really took over here, but I'll be reverting mainly to the original idea soon, the long-awaited and even longer, um, uh, delayed series, Extinct Isle, will be coming to my channel sometime between late August and early September. Also, if you didn't see on my Instagram, go follow it. Um... I ordered a bunch of new figures from Safari, including their Camarasaurus, Feathered Velociraptor, Car and Carnotaurus, among a bunch of others. So, um, with that out of the way, um, let's get into it. So, um, ex main one, that's the name of this exhibit, right? Uh, main one has got two Draco Rex. So you guys need to name all of these in the description. Two Draco Rexes. There's this grayish tan one right here, and there's this green, this nice like jade green one there. It has one Stygimolic that you guys can name. It's this deep green with the black, and two Pachycephalosaurs. Which are this tan one that's in charge, and this, uh, I believe this is the original color scheme, or a close variant. As well as two apatosauruses, there's this nice uh, bluish gray one, deep bluish gray, and there's this lighter gray, almost uh, maroonish colored one. Over here we got the Baryonyxes. Here's the one in charge. Black. Black. Nice gold stripe here. Another one that's black with a gold stripe. And then this one, blue with that nice white stripe. They live in this exhibit. And up here are up here's what I've been working on. So we got some viewing platforms here, right? We got these two nice square exhibits to uh here. As well as some viewing towers and monorail stations. The viewing towers were la I just added in. They're not my proudest thing. I do have to say so. I do have to say that. Can I just place something down that removes that, uh, there we go, that'll do, so it's not obscured anymore, yeah, so on the right side is our raptor pen, a uh, nice oasis, like in my safari park, and a lot of sand, and some palm trees scattered about with some bushes, find the one in charge first. So you guys need to name all of these guys. So there's four, I believe. This one's in charge. Nice tan color scheme here. There's this one in this light gray. Another tan one. And this green, this greenish one. Opposite of them are the ceratosaurs. Here's the alpha, this green and black color scheme, which I've, uh, which I 
This is the first time I've used it. And this one that you saw in the safari park as the prominent skin there. The white and black one. They have this nice forested area and they have this kind of cavern with rocks. So my idea is I want to do two monorail stations that have stops adjacent to each other and I want one to be going one way and another one to be going another way. So back here, I kind of made this little freeform area. So you get off here, emergency shelter, go around here, little garden area, some rocks, go to this viewing platform. And then you look into this small little area here. It's not the mo it's uh it's a nice it's a little thing. Uh it's not big, it's not overly impressive. I'm just going to plug in my controller so that Stuff's more smooth, even if I can't do certain things. And there is a dinosaur in here. It's a Metricanthosaurus. This is the only other color scheme I have, and I've never used it. It's this nice light green and yellow one that you guys have to name. You just got this nice uh, enclosure. It's like a clearing style enclosure, because I figured, like, they live in the forest and they come out into the, this clearing area with just some water, only a couple trees and these rocks. Right, so then over here is the area I'm working on. This is the first double stop area. So I got this exhibit here. Now I want you guys to tell me what you- I, I'm keeping this area. Uh, well, if you want me to do something different to here, or if you want me to do something different to here, um, make, uh, just tell me in the comments. Also, for naming the animals, just say, like, blue apatosaurus, or green pachycephalosaurus, or, or, not green, well, you know, or alpha pachycephalosaurus. Um, or the alpha raptor, or just the metri. Or just the Stigimola. So I want you guys to tell me what you think about this area. Um, and I'm going to start doing a little bit of freeform here as well. I want to make this an electrifying... Oh, an electrifying experience. I want to keep that pillar there. I believe there's still that fence I gotta fix. Yep. I'm just gonna put a gate down in the back corner. And also, yes, the final part of my safari is coming soon. Uh, well, eventually. Right. So... I don't really have an idea, I'm just gonna go with the flow, really. Okay, here's what I'm thinking.
show us some closer action. And just use some water to flatten everything out. I'll let you guys pick what happens in this exhibit entirely in the comments. So yeah, I know, a lot of stuff to do in the comments. You guys can pick what you want to do in that exhibit. And I think I have like all the amenities covered, really. I don't think I have a fossil thing. I think I'm gonna have a fossil zone up here. And a, a, a crypto shop up here. This would be like a kid corner. So I think some uh, smaller dinosaurs maybe for this area. Well, definitely. The crypto size too. There's just kind of this mess of an intersection here. So with this exhibit, I was thinking about adding some Tritonosaurus. I think just a pair of Tritons and a single Iguanodon. Now I'm going to uh, uh, just skip over a lot of the park right now just to outline for you guys what's going to eventually be the T Rex area. The park.
cutting this way. So this is gonna be the T-Rex Kingdom. So I'm going to have a electrified concrete once I flatten this area out. I'm going to put a big uh, electrified concrete wall and a block. around the whole facility. This is going to be the T-Rex Kingdom. For Monorail. This is going to be the Monorail Corner. going to do a bypass. Line station. No, I'm not gonna. Yeah. So. I wanna make a loop, but I can't. I really can't.
I know this track's getting a little confusing. But it'll all make sense in a bit. He's gonna come out over the T-Rex kingdom. And then go in to the T-Rex kingdom. So now, um, oh, did I seriously just loop this? Uh, that's just one big loop now, isn't it? Um, so this track's gonna follow this one around. Actually, it wouldn't make no sense if it disconnected there. But. I want it to be later down the line. So. Now I got this empty track here. Okay, at least the lines are parallel now, but this looks a little small for a T-Rex kingdom. Well, this would be the, uh... That would be that. Down here, there would be a gap in the fence. Put some viewing galleries. Wow. So,
Like that. And that will be the T-Rex Kingdom. Now I'm not gonna add any more dire dinosaurs in here yet. So... Oh well. I have the dinosaurs in my lab here. I'll release them and then we'll end the video. Stop running! We'll put the iguanodon in there, we'll put the two tritons in there. Um, you guys can name the, any of the di all of the dinosaurs you saw in this video if you want in the comments. Um, and the next videos you'll see from me will probably be uh, collection updates and uh, extinct dial. Collecting asset. There will probably n uh, be a slowage of Jurassic World Evolution videos, and then it'll probably stop eventually for a while. Commencing asset transit. Uh, T Rex corner back here. Transporting asset. We activate these stations. And then the employee station Asset should be running. Alright, actually, now that I think about it, these two uh, monorail stations at the main street should be open. They should also be named. This one, this one will be. Campasaurus Station. I definitely spelled that wrong. This one will be... This is on line one, I believe, yeah. Line one is the outer one, yes. So this would be... Yeah. 
that to station two line A. Station three. Station three. Asset has been transported. A. And station four line. Your attention, please. A. This attraction is asset delivered. And this would be main street line B. Is what the monorail line's named? Um, we can deactivate, we can activate this station, and these stations. And, as, and we'll just do some more placement, as, actually we'll just end off here. Here's the Alpha Crichtonosaurus. And the other one. And here is the Guanadon. So, thanks for watching, everyone. And, um, yeah, remember, raptors don't make good pets.